Ashlyn and Stacy. Juliana, wake up. Room, it is an absolute mess. And Julia. In today's video, we're going to do another craft kit. We did it again. We did it one time with that pot painting thing. So that was fun and I really enjoyed that one. So let's just do it again, shall we? Kit we're doing today is called the Craft It Up. It's by Creative Kids. It is the craft kit. DIY macrame cactus. I know that sounds boring and might be, but we're gonna try it together. Um, I'm not good at macrame, so this might not turn out great, but I'm gonna have to use some assistance and stuff. But I actually, I think this might work. Yeah, we're gonna get straight into it, so. So first thing we're gonna do is open the box. Okay, and now we're just going to pull the supplies. My word, that is literally all that is in the box. There's nothing else in here. There's just string. There's no instructions. Oh my word, I almost had a heart attack. There is instructions. Oh man, I thought, like there's no instructions on the back. Man, that looks creepy. Okay. It's a weird angle. I'm trying to decide if it is. Um, we're gonna see if we can open this up here. And we just have two balls of yarn, okay. And we have the instruction booklet. Wow, pictures and everything. We got, okay, so let's just read these instructions. Let's just start step by step. First, cut six. 13 inch and 624 inch white strings. Separate them into two bundles. Okay, let's do it. Boom. Okay, we have our two groups of string sitting over there. So now it is time for step two. So. Let's just stay organized here and cross out each step as we get to it. So, okay, we did that. It's crossed off. We're going to do step number two. Take the green string and make a pretzel knot shaped knot, a pretzel shaped knot around one of the bundles of the white string about one inch from the end. My first question, what is a pretzel knot? I have never heard of it before. And the second question is it says just around one of the bundles of white string. Just one of the bundles? Like, which one do I try? I'm really confused right now. I don't know what a pretzel knot is, so I might have to look it up. It just assumes you know it. How dumb is that? Um, okay, that's about how we're going to have that. That's really bad. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'm just trying to get these things here. Not anything too interesting. Okay. We have our knots that are semi. Oh, I just messed it up. Oh, I messed it up again. Come on. That's good enough. Okay. And we have our knots here. Just, that's just how that's going to be. Uh, that's really bad. Okay. Well, anyway. So we have our knots and our, our one of our strings, it's the 13 inch one, and then we have our green string. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to ask my mom to help me with this one because she helped me with the white one. And then we'll figure out what a pretzel shape is and then get all that figured out, so. Instead of pretzel knot, and we did not do that actually, we just made two knots. Um. Yeah, so I think that will work. I use the smaller thing of string. It doesn't matter which one you use, but I would use the smaller one first. And so it then said tie a second knot and pull it tight. We did both of those. So moving on to the next page. Wrap the second string around the bundle 
of white till you're an inch from the end. So we're just gonna do that like a hundred times. So let's get started. So for this process, I really was just trying to like, like let's just get this done. So I am kind of whatever about it. I wrapped that and I wrapped that and I wrapped it and it was so boring. And I wasn't even listening to music or anything. It was really weird. I probably should have listened to music, but I didn't. So here I am wrapping this string. Oh, it took forever. I was just sick of it by the end. Oh my word. Okay, back on track here. Um, we did that. Ching. And now we're on to the fifth direction of nine. Make two make two knots with the green string to tie it off, which we have done here. We have, yeah, there. So that's our final completed string. So we have more. Isn't that awful? Continue reading. Now wrap your other bundle of white, white with green string the same way. So you have two wrapped bundles. So we need to wrap this yet and this is long like just you know how long this took um this thing took and just imagine how long this took i can't even fit it in screen it's so long it's 24 inches okay like that's maybe not as long as you think but it felt like forever so anyway i don't know i guess we're gonna have to do number five I will probably do most of this after supper, but I might get on started with it. I just don't want to do it because it's really annoying. And we still have four more um, instructions after we finish the wrapping of that string, which is probably going to take half an hour or longer. So, great. See, the thing is, I probably should like listen to something, but I never really got into that. So, I guess we'll see what we can get done with the other string. I don't think I'm actually gonna film this part because it's really not necessary because I'm literally just going. So, okay, it's like literally the next day and I have finished wrapping all of this. It took forever, anyway. But I just did everything I did for this one. And yeah, I just did that. And we are ready to move on to step six. Shape your wrapped strings into a cactus and add glue from home to on one side. Or insert paper clips under the green string and bend into place. So it looks like here we're going to shape our cactus. So let's do that. <laughs> Now this looks so bad like that's ex like that's literally what it looks like anyway and then it says and glue on one side so literally cover the one side completely with glue pretty much so I guess I'm gonna mess with this I don't think I'll film it because I kind of like want to make it easy and so I can just like stare at it and don't have to worry about the camera so we're going to do that, and I'll come back when it's completed. Okay, final review. No, just joking. That's what it looks like. We used hot glue. So that was cool. It was a little bit um, hard, and oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, my camera's falling down. Oh, dear. Uh, that's not gonna work. Okay, I think I'm more steady. That was weird. Okay, so back on track. So that's what it looks like. It doesn't look great, but I'm happy with it enough to move on. And bringing back in the instruction manual that we've been using this entire process. We have completed phase six. We're gonna move on to phase seven. Tie together the two excess green strings at the bottom with two knots. So, um, what? So we need to tie these together. Except we should be tying these together. So what happened? See, 
So that happened. I had extra string. So I'm trying to decide if I cut it like right here. I could use this string and tie another knot right here. Do you think that's a bad idea? I'm not sure about it. I'm gonna go ask some advice here. So I actually did get that done here. My mom, I got, I got some advice and we ended up, I cut a little past the knot, unraveled it and my mom tied a new knot. So I think we're good and on track. I'm just going to cut this a little shorter because we don't need it that long. And we're going to literally get into step six. Or step seven, which said the one that we already read. So we're tying together the excess strings on the bottom. So we're literally going to go, uh, if I can find these strings here. Like, just tie these two together. So we're going to do that with two knots um yeah we're gonna see here very tight um yeah it's kind of a little bit tedious actually because you gotta just get every single string and I there's just for this I tied those two together and now it's time for the other side. Okay, we have actually completed step seven because we tied both of those together. I did one on the front and then I did the other one on the back just because I didn't really like how it looked in the front. So, ching. Step seven is completed and now we're on to phase eight. It says, cut off the extra green strings once they are secured with knots. So we have secured them with knots. And now we're going to cut off the extra strings because we have a few of those. So boomity, boomity, boom we go. I just did that. So now there are no more strings and it's just simply cut off. So and last but not least, phase seven, nine. Make a loop of about six inches of string and loop it through itself at the top of the cactus. So it would end up being right here. So I have some string. Is this six inches? I still have my um, thing out here. If we could just go like that. Oh my word, oh my word, my word. Okay. Um, if I just go like this, then this is easier for me to see. Here is boobity boobity doo. Wow, we have some to spare. Okay, I'm gonna cut this right here. Just look, uh, where's the camera? Like, okay. Shaboom. Well, oh dear, oh dear. See, this is a very bad camera setup. Okay, I'm just left that. I am letting it like that. I don't want it to fall. Okay. And then we're just going to loop it right through the hole of this cactus right here. Go jigaboo. Oh, pff, fell out. Just boomity like that. And we're going to just tie this right together. I actually finished that right here just like that. And just for a finish, finishing touch, I'm going to cut these all evenly so that it looks a lot better because these are not very even. And that is completed your craft. Um, they don't have similarities, but yet they're kind of cool. I actually don't mind these. This, I think, is a great gift idea, and it might be, but... Yeah, it's actually a lot bigger than I expected, so I guess we will cross this out, and I'll give you a... Good job. Good job. You did it. Good job. Good job. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, It might have been a little 
it was a little bit stressful just like getting everything just right because they didn't have perfect instructions but to read this kit it i would probably um maybe three out of ten, five three out of five stars if i had to read this so i hope you enjoyed it if you enjoy long tedious crafts i mean seriously just get it um also you can even do it yourself if you just follow my instructions anyway i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell and like the video and bye